go ahead and bring the chart out here and let's move to the daily first of all um, daily we can see we're in an uptrend we've got these channels which captures you know 95 percent of the price action over the last uh, eight months or so uh, let's move into the one hour get a better time frame and what i saw is another symmetrical triangle here on labu biotech now symmetrical triangles can break either upwards or downwards but my point here is to show that um, volatility should increase um, you know as we get closer now to this apex point right here um so let's see here anything to report of interest let's go into the 30 minute and really take a good look at this symmetrical triangle so much like with jnug we have a move up and then we have our a b c d and e and then remember what i was saying about um jnug here let's go and delete this one sec because what trading theory says should happen is we should retest here and then go up higher um, and what we might be doing is this retest right now so my theory for biotech is that it might head up higher as soon as it bounces off this trend line that we've got right here and what do we see we've got a um, this might be a hammer let's go ahead and look at our candlesticks and see if this is a hammer let's go to the 15 yeah well it looks more like a piercing candle right here. I'm going to trade this. Change this back to uh, Ikenashi. But I really like uh, LABU right now. This blue line. Um, let's go to the 30. I drew this blue line here because it is kind of a second triangle uh, that we see here. I wasn't sure whether I wanted to look at the, you know, um, the high of this move right here and uh, bring it all the way down and you see it touches this high this high and then comes back down or if we're looking at a longer term symmetrical triangle with this blue tri with this blue line um, where it touches right here and goes right here right here um, oftentimes we do have this touch right here i just didn't draw it here in my uh, um, example chart um, but a lot of times when you have the touch up here instead of the touch right down here um, it's a bearish indication uh, let's go ahead and um, have these uh, drawn out actually but we see that you know we like to see price move upwards retouch here and then go up for a bullish breakout above um, and uh, it doesn't have a counter example of it, but when price moves down, makes this touch here, and then moves down, a lot of times we, um, you know, move downwards. But again, like I said, um, if this high here, this line I drew, this black line, um, is valid, I think we broke out and we're retesting right now and we're going to move higher. However, if this blue line is true, um, we might, you know, uh, you might see a bounce here and then it'll head lower so let's go ahead and uh, draw that right here you might see that all right so that is labu these are two short-term predictions on what might happen to price either way i think that we're going to bounce here pretty soon and we're going to head upwards and retest this triangle this blue line here next up is natural gas you guys 